So picking a graphics card becoming ever so confusing with many options, as now we also have Intel GPU available in the market including Nvidia and AMD, to make it easier for you in this video. We have covered best graphics cards under $300 that are suitable for gaming and other productive work. First, let us begin with the Intel Arc A750 graphics card, which is the cheapest on our list, currently available at around $233. This GPU is capable of delivering solid gaming performance at 1080p gaming challenges GPUs like RTX 3060 and Radeon RX 6600 XT. In fact, in many games, this GPU beats RTX 3060 and you can see benchmarks on your screen to understand the capacity of this GPU. The best part is this GPU also has advanced features such as ray tracing, moreover. It also has HDMI 2.1 and DisplayPort 2.0 support makes it future-proof option. As the price dips under $200 at times, the boost clock speed is up to 2400 MHz and 8GB GDDR6 size deals with even 1440p gaming, delivering satisfying performance. This GPU comes with 225W power draw, so suggest you to use minimum 600W PSU. However, the downside is, it is only compatible with Intel 10th generation and AMD Zen 3 CPUs or even higher CPU, and it also requires a motherboard chipset that supports either feature. So don't consider it if you're planning to upgrade GPU with older setup, go for it link in the description. Next, we have MSI RTX 3060 GPU under $300. Now even though this GPU falls behind compared to some of the AMD GPUs and raw performance, Yet with its high quality and vink encoder, NVIDIA broadcast, and deep learning super sampling, still the most attractive option for creators and gamers at the budget. Additionally, I really like this GPU for its space and energy efficiency as it requires only a 170 watt power draw, so you can use a power supply of around 550 to 750 watts all depending on the CPU you have assembled in your setup. There is also HDMI and DisplayPort, and fans work efficiently. Whereas specs such as 3584 CUDA cores, 12 GB of VRAM on a 192-bit hub, and 1807 MHz maximum clock speed are suitable for almost all modern games at 1080p with 60 FPS. You can also play games at 1440p by tweaking the settings at the lower side. Rest you can see gaming benchmarks on your screen to understand its performance capability, overall solid option for ray tracing support, and also suitable for creators making it a budget option for PC builders. Now it's time to discuss the Radeon RX 6700 GPU. This is a cheaper version of the RX 6700 XT GPU from AMD, which offers good performance at a more budget-friendly price range, even though it is older option compared to the RTX 40 series and Radeon 7000 series GPUs. Yet it is extremely value for money option for GPU under the $300 price tag as it has a decent GPU size capacity of up to 10 GB and a maximum clock speed of up to 2425 MHz making it a decent option for 1440p gaming. As it easily handles 1080p gaming at high to ultra preset, benchmarks on your screen. Pause the video for details, but for 1440p gaming you might need to lower the settings to boost FPS. This GPU requires a minimum 650 watt system power supply in your setup. Overall, it is quite effective and silent compared to other GPUs. But what holds this back from RTX 3060 is its ray tracing capacity, which is pretty average. But turning on FSR might improve frame rates here and there. It's definitely best for your needs, especially to play more modern games. Link in the description check the latest price. At first position, we have the RTX 4060 GPU. Now I know it has very negative feedback as it does not have major upgrades compared to the last generation GPU from NVIDIA. Yet it outperforms the RTX 3060 GPU at certain games and DLSS 3 frame generation is a game changer for building a gaming PC. As AI generated frames manage to deliver outstanding FPS and heavy gaming titles. However, I agree it has fewer cores and memory size than RTX 3060. But due to its DLSS 3 and ray tracing, it is one of the best budget GPUs for gaming under $300. You can run games smoothly and gaming benchmarks on your screen. However, this is slightly above $300 which makes it slightly expensive on our list, but the best gaming option. Moreover, if you do not care about frame generation, you can consider RTX 3060 or RX 6700 GPU. 
This GPU requires a minimum 550 watt power supply, so consider it carefully. So, these are our recommendations for GPUs under $300 in the United States. All these are capable enough to handle 1080p gaming, but for 1440p gaming, you need to lower the settings to get better gaming output. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Till then, keep supporting and subscribe to our channel.